Hello and welcome to Willow and Pine Studios where in this video I'm going to be sharing with you my top three tools that I use as a social media content creator. Now I know that your time is valuable so we're going to jump straight into it. Since their launch in 2013, Canva continues to grow and expand into one of the leading content creation platforms. There are many different tools that you can use inside Canva and my personal favorite being the royalty free images. Having a large gallery of royalty free images at your fingertips can be a benefit to any workflow and make it a lot more streamlined. However, in saying this, not every image can be sourced from inside Canva and you will have to source it from elsewhere. The second reason I love Canva for my business and content creation is for their integrated teams. For sharing a workable file is a lot more straightforward now. In the past, to share a workable file, you would have to export and share that file, therefore sometimes losing quality. Wherefore now you can just hit that share button and share it straight to your team members Canva. Canva is good, however, for more accuracy, I use Adobe Creative Cloud in a majority of my content creation. Some programs that I use are Illustrator, InDesign and Photoshop. As a graphic designer and content creator, these programs are essential for exact measurement, file size and export type. Now, it can be quite costly, so instead of buying the whole suite, you can just purchase the individual program that you need to save a little bit of money. Another thing to be mindful of is the learning curve that comes with these programs, as they are quite extensive. However, in the end, it is totally worth it for the high level of accuracy that they offer. The third and final tool that I will be talking about today is Meta Business Suite. Being able to schedule in advance is crucial to content creation. And in Meta Business Suite, you can schedule to both Facebook and Instagram at once. In the past, I have used other scheduling platforms such as Later, Buffer and Zendable, which are fantastic and have thorough insights and different scheduling tools that Meta Business Suite does not offer. However, at this point in time, I do use Meta Business Suite as it is free and it is what myself and my clients prefer to use. So there you have it. Three tools that I use as a content creator. Did any of these tools come as a surprise to you or do you already use them for yourself? Now, we do have a podcast where we publish actionable pieces of information every fortnight here on YouTube and on Spotify. So be sure to check it out. If you liked today's video, please like and subscribe to let us know that you did like it. See you next time, guys. Thank you. Mm -hmm.